Hey, I'm Thatch Wynn, founder of Thatch Real Estate. So I am here at this bank-owned property where I am looking to buy this property and uh, basically uh, see if there's an opportunity where I can buy it, fix it up, and flip it. So as I was walking up, I noticed some of the benefit. Like it has vinyl siding, which is low maintenance. It has already double-pane window, which is good, right? I said that it smells a little bit like doo-doo out here, which is good because, you know, it needs some work. But the more work it needs, the better the price is going to be. So we're going to go inside, we're going to see what this thing looks like and see, uh, you know, what I see. So right now, it smells uh, like there's odor, it smells like there's urine in here. Again, this doesn't intimidate me because I see this all the time, right? The wall obviously needs to be redone, the floors probably going to be redone or buffed out, okay? This right here used to be the garage, but they converted this into a larger living room area kind of thing. And uh, this whole thing, obviously, uh, it needs to work. Sunroof, it doesn't look like it don't have any stains, so it looks like the sunroof thing leaking. So this whole thing, this is a family room. They extend this house, the family room in the back. So the question is going to be is, what the roof look like outside? But the family room obviously needs to be finished. They started the fireplace. It didn't look like it finished. Right? This house, right now they're asking 139, I think. It's definitely worth 139. Okay? Here's the kitchen. There's nothing here. There's a big giant sliding door needs to be here. Ain't here no more. Uh, the kitchen. Right, no refrigerator. The floor is probably going to be replaced. It's not that attractive. Right, the I'll uh, probably you know keep in the cabinets on this. I buy this, but pretty much the rest of the countertop will look really cheesy. So I just get rid of it. I'll buy this. So interesting how this thing looks. So, inside the bathroom, there's tiles. They got new tile surrounding, which is fine. Have a little nice new fixture in here, which is workable. It's, it's workable. And there's three bedrooms here. So what I noticed with the bedroom is that all these bedrooms are actually pretty small. They're not that big. Okay. So uh, you know it's okay. It's workable. You know what I mean? I mean, in the home in this area, bedrooms are small, which is fine. The key to the B is what you can get this house for, what it costs to finish it. And uh, that's the next thing I have to do pretty much uh, to run the number to see how much it costs to finish this, finish this thing. So pretty much you guys, this is what a fixer looks like. This is if you want to be in the business of investing. This is what you gotta go through. This is what I see all the time. And uh, you know, to me, this is not bad. I see worse. And uh, so, you know, what I'm gonna do now, look at this whole thing, and then I'm going to analyze what I think it's gonna cost to fix this, right? And then figure out what this thing is worth when it's done, and then see how much of a profit I like to make on this property, and work backwards and determine what I will pay for this property. So stay tuned, let you know how it goes, right? Remember, you guys always dream big and serve unconditionally.